Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 9 React tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about use controller with React component. So let's see how can we do this. So first of all, let's create a new controller. So go to the command prompt and run the command php artisan make colon controller a space controller name. Uh, let's say controller name is a post controller. Okay, now hit enter. Controller created. Now run the application. So write here PHP artisan serve. Alright, now switch to the project and let's open the post controller. So just go inside the app directory and then HTTP controllers. And from here, let's open this one post controller.php file. And inside this controller, uh, let's create a function here public function and function name index and inside this function just return here uh, return inertia column column call the render method so right here render and inside this render method let's pass here the component path okay which is you can see here inside the resources directory views uh, sorry js pages and post okay here is the post component so inside this render method just add here the uh, first of all add the directory name which is the posts so right here posts forward slash component name which is the post component okay now save this file now let's create the route for this. So go to the routes directory and open web.php file. And uh, inside this route, uh, let's remove this function and add here the controller name. So inside the big bracket here, big bracket, and just write here controller name, which is the post controller column column class and then method name which is uh, this one index so right here index all right and also give the route name so right here name post dot index Okay, now save this file inside the post component.jsx file. Uh, let's change here the text. Uh, let's add here the text the React component with controller. Now save this file and let's check. So switch to the browser. And go to the URL, post URL, okay, hit enter, and you can see here the component. So, in this way, you can use controller with the React component. So, that's all about use controller with React component in Laravel 9. So, thanks for watching this video. And if you still have any kind of question, you can ask me in the comment box. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.